Christina Rich is a breast cancer survivor, a moniker she never expected to wear, but does so very proudly. And data shows one in seven women will be diagnosed with breast cancer in her lifetime. Yeah, certainly scary, but new mm. treatments are making breast cancer easier to cure. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> There's nothing Christina Rich loves more than her family. So she was worried when she found a lump in her breast. And I found the lump and went in to see my nurse. You know, she goes, ah, you're young, it's probably nothing, but let's get it checked out. It was something. It was stage two hormone positive, HER2 negative cancer. I burst into tears on the phone. Then the battle began. Christina had a lumpectomy, radiation and chemotherapy. I just had to take it a day at a time. She says the hardest part was isolating from her family. Days seven, eight, and nine after each treatment, my white blood cell count would drop. So I wasn't allowed to be around anybody because of COVID mainly. While the treatment was difficult, advancements in drugs have improved the management of breast cancer. It's a very exciting time to be in a cancer treatment paradigm. Dr. Minog Bupathi is a medical oncologist with Rocky Mountain Cancer Center. You're seeing some phenomenal responses with much better tolerability from toxicity and your, your patients are living longer. Christina is proud to be a survivor. It was a big wake up call for me, for my boys, because I couldn't imagine not being there every week for their soccer games and cheering them on and helping with homework. Oh, so strong. Christina mm. is at risk for the cancer to come back, so she's taken several drugs to curb her hormone production, and she's in a trial for one new drug as part of her therapy. Love to see that. I know. She's so strong. Incredible. We're going to take a look at the damage.